bless America and all the men and women that has kept us free. Well, here we go on uh, motor blogging. Ah, everybody's got their little golf carts out today. Well, I could go down and see my little town. That's what I'll do. much battery left in the camera so let me close my visor down and my oh man I bet that sounds different you're probably not hearing all the noise we don't have much going for us in our little town I go up and do the grand tour The old building finally fell down. Look at that. Uh, back in the 1800s, that used to be the hospital. Hello. That's a beautiful place up there. This is just a test. We'll, we'll improve up on it as time goes by. I may cut the wire and shorten it down somewhat. But you got to keep in mind I've got a, a modular, modular helmet. I hope my battery is still running, I don't know. Dead man's curve. I've been living out here, I think 20, 27 years, out here in the woods. We don't have any technology. We don't have almost anything. It's a it's country living at its finest. I hope I don't sound like Gomer Pyle on here. But that's not a bad thing. Old Gomer is a pretty good boy. hope the wind noise ain't too bad but we'll know in a few minutes we just done this little old short short ride just to test the microphone out and it might not even get published I may not even put it out because um, it might be too pitiful yeah this is harder redneck country here the heart of Dixie, Alabama. Sweet home, Alabama. Old Ray Gregory, he lives up in that uh, wooded area like I do. And um, 
Oh my gosh. Uh, I tell you somebody I really I really envy you. That's Red Rider. She lives up there in British Columbia. And if you guys was ever stationed at Fort Lewis, that's one of the America's biggest training centers. Um, Fort Lewis has them big tall fir trees. And on a good day, you can see Mount Rainier and Mount Adams and Mount St. Helens and Mount Baker. And if you're in the right place there, you can even see Mount Hood down in Portland. It all depends. It all depends on where you're where you're at when you're. Woohoo! We're doing some redneck stuff now. That road's so rough over there. I try to avoid riding on it. I paid a guy $2,800 to put this rock in here and uh, never did I think he was going to um, leave it so rough but hey you get what you pay for <laughs> come on little boy all right Well, here we are, back to home.